We're almost at the theater now. The metro entrance should be pretty close. But however small the distance is, you'll have to cover it on the surface. And there, every step you take could well be your last. Bring it on. Welcome back to Metro Last Light Redux, everybody. Chuvak, we're here. Pull yourself together. We don't have long before nightfall, okay? Okay, with the tunnel collapse, the only way to reach the escalator down to the other station is cross the surface. And trust me, we don't want to be caught out here in the fucking dark. Opa, we're in luck, Artyomich! This place seems lived in. Rangers probably, I don't know. And when there are rangers? Shit! Short on filters. Okay. We'll have to make do. Now come on, take what you need. We're all brothers in the metro. I am going to be with you in a second, sir. I've found a key. I need to find the safe. It might not be in this room, but I have to check. I have to look around. I also have to read that note before we go. I don't think it's in this building for some reason. I think the safe will be in another room. Okay, let's read the note. Oh, I've got enough out of that? Okay. Since the day we ended up in the metro, I have gone up to the surface only a few times. The background radiation is too high there, so frequent ventures out translate into grave illnesses to those brave enough to attempt them. One has to stay constantly alert on the surface. The pollution tends to be uneven. There are hot spots which, are, uh, which could dole out a lethal dose of radiation in a matter of minutes, while some places could actually be habitable if not for the monsters and unbearable gloominess. The eye can't discern between a safe place and a hot spot. You have to use a Geiger counter. You can't go out to the surface without a gas mask either. We used to own the earth. Today, although I still remember that summer day in the gardens with my mum, I almost can't believe it ha actually happened. I can't believe I used to live in one of those tall houses and could look up at the sky every day. It's as, it's as if the metro was always my home, but I still miss the world we lost. Well, you're being quite sentimental in this one, aren't you? Ooh, more stuff. It seems warning. Oh, the Nazis must have took my no other one. Let's move forward. Yeah, 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 I know, I know, I know. Hey, Priyashi, just... I could use a good watch like yours. Knowing how much air you got left is a must, huh? So, let's move? Sure, I do often ignore it, so let's go. You know, I've heard of things roaming around that even bullets can stop. You have been through some bad shit, I know, but not like what's coming. Oh yeah, yeah, Achoo. really amp- Remember, if you want to live, don't drop your guard for an instant, okay? Why is it so bright? Whoa, that's impressive. That's what she said. I heard about this place. That plane was headed into Moscow when the whole city caught fire. Uh, the building where it crashed, that's the entrance to the theater. The ice is towing up here. It's almost like spring, huh, Artyomich? Maybe we'll live to see the summer. I... I think... I Why think I've been over there. There's got to be an underground path somewhere around here. The rangers would never cross the square out in the open. Okay. We could walk down the wing here. Okay, so much for the sun. Those clouds moved in fast. Oh, great. Yeah. Oh, oh, just... We got one moment of paradise! You are my own. Oh my god! Please stop! The atmosphere just went crazy! Literally! Oh, what do we got? Nothing. That's good. Geiger counter. Kicking off. Gonna look around. You never know what you're gonna find. Over here? Oh, oh, you're pointing me in the direction of a corpse I can loot? You're saying you're too good for this? I don't believe that at all. 
You've gone very quiet since the clouds decide to go uh, over the sun. Check for filter, Artyom. You want to swap your mask? Do it fast. This poor bastard won't be needing his. Oh. Just one way. Yeah, yeah. Think I'm gonna be sick. Tread carefully. They say these tunnels shelter more than just mutants. A good communist doesn't believe in cells, Artyom. But this fucking place of death makes me, uh, wonder. This is horrendous. What is that? I got good karma because I went into a room. That's nice. Where can I, uh... Charge this up. I keep getting things stuck on my face. I don't even know what this is. Is it a dog? It was a dog. Now it's just a pile of guts. There's nothing around here. We should keep moving. I don't have the... Uh... Let's go out to the light. What was that? I saw a shadow. Check that service room. Oh, yeah. This man has boots on. He's also missing a lot of the rest of him. From decay. Bleh. I don't... I... I brightened the last, um... video for you because... Good golly, Miss Molly. It was dark. A shotgun. Whoa! Uh, um, 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 um. That's that's good. Tinnitus sounds. Thanks very much for that. What did I, what did I drop for all of that? It doesn't matter. So I put mine down. I've dropped the bastard gun. I will... I have something for shotgun ammo here, so... I kind of like this pistol, though. I kind of like this. I don't really care for this. Now, I know people are going to be like, you taking the bastard gun? I'm... I am. Yes. I got the karma from this room. I don't need any more of it. You, sir, do you have any... No? You have nothing? Wait. He does have something. I can't get over there. It doesn't matter. Okay, I gotta keep an eye on, um... You get you up. You're all covered with blood. Yes. Did you not hear the commotion? I don't stop! Get down, now! Watchman! You are your huge back! The storm must be driving them. Stay calm, If they spot us, we Well, let's go somewhere dark, then! That was close. Okay, Artyom, no more tricks like that. Let's get to the plane before another pack comes through. Move it! Oh, you want me to run now? Yeah, but I want to look around. You don't tell me what to... What, 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 what? You and the lead, I follow. Oh, I... Uh, yeah. Uh, there seems to be a lot of grass sounds. I, I think it's me. about this place. Weird shit happens here. Hey, try opening it. I'll get cover. I am looking around, sir. You don't have anything to worry about. I'm not going far. I'm looking at you. This place is irradiated. I should move away. Am I dying? Jump. Oh, bleh. Let's try together. Moving. Go, go in. Rip the damn door off! Look, Artyom, don't lose your head in here. You understand me? Okay, let's go. Um... One ranger told me this was a flight from Mallorca. Family is returning from vacation, you know? You know, Artyom, I've never been to this field. I've been myself. Yeah, well, 
Wasn't meant to be. Uh, there's some weird shit happening in my mind. I feel... I don't know, I feel... Weird. Tell me about it. You sound weird. I mean, you look weird. Are you seeing this shit too? Oh, God, is he having visions as well? Artyom, what is this? What is what? The visions? I think they're just... Shoot, you! Look! They're alive! Oh, he is seeing shit, yeah. <laughs> they're definitely not alive, sir. The story is being told so well in this game. He's completely freaking me out, though, because he's acting so weird. Intense, man. I had to breathe. <laughs> smoke. Smoke. Too much smoke. <laughs> There's no smoke, buddy. Breathe. I had to breathe. Put your gas mask on, you idiot. Smoke. Smoke. Too much smoke. <laughs> Slap him. <laughs> <laughs> they showed so much more of that than I was expecting. The red line is one of the biggest and strongest states in the metro, occupying almost a whole line. But for as long as I can remember, the Reds always used to preach that their goal was the installation of communism throughout the whole of the metro. The restoration of a destroyed state that used to be based on the ideals of equality and justice. The problem is the independent stations keep their distance from the red line as best they can, which means they can't restore the red state without strife. Yes, the reds are no angels, but what the Nazis are doing uh, is regular horror. I am happy to have an ally like Pavel, even if he's red. <laughs> yeah? What? Will you? If you hadn't woke me, I'd probably have suffocated. Yeah. Like the others did. Oh, like... This one. Like this one, yeah. Okay. Okay, okay, let's get out of this place now. Now! Dude. Dude. Ashum, go right. I think we'll find the entrance behind the building. <sighs> oh, I think I fucked up. Take it down, take it down! Oh my god! Are we really fighting this thing? It took me an entire game to kill! Oh god! Ow! Ow! I'm gonna be honest, that didn't go well. How do I heal? I'm sorry! How do I heal? I don't remember how to heal. Zed? Nope. All right, let's move forward. I don't remember how to, you know, put uh, plasma back in my system. What? Is that guy wearing a gas mask with no filter? That's terrifying. Can the world stop exploding? All right, there's nothing here. Yeah, pick up the pace is fine. Oh, it's on the floor. Pick up the pace is fine. I'm looking around. This is this is a part of the game. I have to. It seems like I have to run in from uh, to build into building because I'm running out of time. 
Oh, I have three minutes of oxygen left, so we should get back in this building. Go! Fucking watch oh. As soon as we moved away from the plane, and we were almost there, huh? We're moving in from the second floor! Whoa! What is the noise? Is Come it a giant? Here. Follow me. Go! Give me a hand! Oh, God! Faster! More are coming! We have you gotta find the entrance! Oh, God! We're landing right in front of me! We need to go, we need to go, we need to go, we need to go. Open up! Open up! Let us see you, bastards! Hold down! Whoa! One more! Hold on! Oh god, I didn't reflect it! The fucking bastard gun! Please open the fucking gate! Wow! Inside, move! Oh, good idea. Really? Them's the top lads, everybody. <laughs> the top lads. Like a stroll through the park, huh? Our short visit to dead Moscow, the phantom of the past, is over. Pavel and I helped each other out again and are returning down to the metro as real partners now. You can't survive the wastelands any other way. But now ahead of us lies a populated station, the theater. It's very close to Polis. If Pavel manages to lead me through the red line guard posts, I'll be home in less than an hour. I have... But you know, every time we think it's going to be easy, it just gets so much worse. Okay, come on in. Sorry about that. Dangerous times, right? We're going up soon. Are there many watchmen around? We were lucky to get here. Yes! Okay, there's a nest in the building by direct plane. I don't wonder it's such a bad dream today. Oh, you want a nightmare? Why, well, it's waiting for you up there. I still have a key for a safe I'm never going to use. To clear a nest, we need a couple squads at least. Oh, I want that. You're not going? We need to gather them in first. We're waiting for the guys. On their way. Then we'll give the beasts some hell. Good talk, guys. Is no one going to actually... Welcome yeah. to the theater. Oh, thank you. Someone actually welcomed me. Yoink. Don't worry about it. Come on in. Someone's always got to be crying. Why is there no joy? For each campaign, a lot of people in the Reich are accused of being mutants. Well, if you enlist, they acknowledge you as a person. But anyone deemed unnecessary is chased off or hung. So you're here. Is that all of you, or are more coming? We're all here. Two trains, as agreed. Our people from the first one, did they get permission to enter? Still waiting. They're giving our chief hell, but there's nothing he can do about it. So, maybe while they're talking, you could let us in? No, we can't. Sorry, that's forbidden, without a permit. How about just the kids? And leave the parent here? 
No, you better just wait there. But you did let the first group in. No, they're sitting on their train at the transfer track. Be grateful you're on the platform where you have some space. Wow. Understood. Oh, wow, I got a good comment Please for watching everyone. the story unfold. Our That's great. Are still being negotiated, so they told us to wait here. And what about the kids? They need rest. How long do we have to wait here? Yes, how long? I can't wait no more. I got a pee. Oh, that's Silence. awful. How could this they told us to wait, We've been so in the wreck all our lives, However, and now we're freaks? We're having some gl uh, graphical glitches right now. all the time. But why? Why to us? They keep raising the standards. Last time it was our neighbors. This time, it's us. Would be long before Fiora has this station to himself. But what do we do now? Live! And be glad we won't have our skulls measured every day. Wow. Oh. I'm I'm fainting. Hard to breathe. Oh, calm down. Take yes, that breath. always works. Everything calm down. Right. Everything is fine. Yes, it telling someone who's having a panic attack to calm down always works. Definitely. So, the that's our plan. Now. The station here, next please. to this one is Revolution Square. One of ours. Red. And revolution is spitting distance to police. So, I, as a good communist, which I am, will vouch for you. They'll have to let you through, and you'll be home in no time. What do you think? Are yes. you the one they just told us about? Yes, we are. Great. Come in, then. Oh, God, so, here it my goes. Spartan friend, have a look around. There's plenty to see here, huh? I'll talk to my people and find you. Oh, thank you. Welcome. And have a good rest. But you do a They're actually being nice to me. That's kind of weird. That, I'm not used to that at all. Pavel needs some time to set everything up. The citizens of other stations need a permit to enter the red line. The state in, in permanent preparation for war readily sees a spy in any outsider. So I have some time to look around the theater. This station is a real legend of the Metro, not unlike Polis. The difference being that while Polis gathered most of the surviving scientists, the theater is considered to be the cultural capital of the Metro. The cultural capital? Let's see a show! Someone sing! How oh, I love to mop the floor. No, he's not gonna not gonna give me a number. That number sucked anyway. Sing a better song. Are these are these pigs? Is that what this is? Am I hearing pigs? <laughs> I'm sorry the sound effects coming from there. It's right, it's right, he's shiny. He's a shiny boy. Alright. Let's feed. That's a leak, probably very irradiated. That's that's a pig having a nap. Very good. What you got, buddy? Bullets to the last surviving theatrical critic. Bullets for mercy on your souls. I, I'll give you. I'll give you a bullet. I'll give you a bullet. Go, young men. I see you like my witty sign. There is a place for everyone in this underground. Murderers, whores, tyrants, money changers, even peasants. For Christ's sake, all are welcome here. Even lousy actors. I live like in me. the theater while we breathe the miasma of the decaying Bolshoi. This station's overpopulated with the ghosts of the opera. But is there a place here for the best critic of our once great country? Hell no. I tell the truth. And I am repaid with insults and poverty? I say you are a disgrace to the name of Bolshoi. And they reply, now Bolshoi is us and us alone. They're immune to criticism. They choose money over art. And these poor souls traveling from all over Metro to see the glorious Bolshoi? They are played for fools. They say that art only interests the well-fed. But, my young friend, I will argue that even the hungry need art. For thinking on exalted matters dulls the pain of an empty stomach. But, sadly, True art is 20 years gone. What remains is profane trash. And so my own hunger persists. Will you honor what we've lost by perhaps donating a bullet? Ah, uh, so there are still men, not just marionettes. Right, now you've uh, taken my money, you will stop talking to me. This guy is... Well, he's having a great day. Uh, what he was saying about, uh, 20 years of trash? Yeah, it feels like that in the real world as well. I mean, what? That is some rocking music! What is, what is that, from before the war? 
arms, your body, and soul. Without that, time we may as well end it all. The time of plague. That feather is majestic. Are we having a good day? The masked one with the scythe. Any minute now. So drink up. The masked one with the scythe? Oh, right, both you're talking about a play. I am getting so much good karma by taking my time. Thank you to everyone in the comments telling me to take my time. Is it something new? No, as if mushrooms with mushroom sauce. Hey, keep your hand out of the pot or you're getting smacked in the head. Sorry, Katya, sorry. Why? What happened? Mitya didn't make it. How? We were heading back. A demon appeared. We all hit the ground and shot at the demon until it fled. No one suffered the scratch. But Vitya didn't get up. His mask is a crack open on a brick. And you, you left him there to die. No, Katya, we tried to save him. But it was too late. No! Vidya! We buried him there. The wood place. We put white stones on the grave. Oh god, yeah, oh god, children! Oh, they bounce! I don't understand that. Don't lose your chance! Oh, 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 Dad says it flaps its wings like this when taking off. And my dad saw lots of demons. We're right, Uncle Misha. This is a demon? Well, it's... All right. Let it be a demon. <laughs> there used to be birds like this. It was a bird, yeah. It's just a, they, you know, wouldn't know the difference. Hey, the market! So, Nikitish, when do we become your father? Have you got enough money to last a week? There's so much story going on. Then my life is over. And it took so long to save up. Grenades! Oh, oh good riddance. And At least I had some fun in the head. What? You give up already? Shit. We could still make it to stalkers instead of mere aids. Look, I got money for three days. So drinks are on me. I didn't get anything for that one. Okay, what do you what do you do? Grenades guaranteed to keep your enemy warm. You know what? I have 337. Will work up a I sweat. will buy some. You already have too many. What do you mean you too many? You can never have too many. Okay, so I'm pretty even down, to be perfectly honest with you. Uh, yeah, best stopping power of them all. I don't know whether I want that. I may be swapping good, that out. Despite being handmade. Okay, wait a minute. Okay. The cases ain't new, but these are well made. These, well, these good so luck. angry you faces. Hey. Dollar regular, salad smoke, so add. Lard, roast bacon. Throwing knives. Uh, uh, bread? Bacon? Roasting, fresh All bacon you ever need fresh to live. Fish, fresh fish, Do fresh you? Fish, okay, fish, no. Who's the guy with the with the with always, any more weapons? Weapons. Yo. Okay. So trade in. Because no one likes the bastard gun. Buy this and gain instant respect. This is one respectable item. Sure, it is a single shot gun, but even one blast from it is usually enough. I don't think I want any of these. And you'll never have to fear bandits anymore. I, I have guns. I have decent guns. Hold on. See, this thing has to reload every time. I don't know whether uh, having a duplet would be better. A twin barrel blast into the snout is a winner. Indispensable for self-defense. Hmm. It can't hit things from afar, but it sure is deadly in a close fight. But I already have one. You know what? I'm going to keep the uh, weapons I have. I'm just going to customize things. I think I have customized it as good as I can, right? 
are going to have to stock. I know people get upset when I play with the Master Gun. I don't know why. It's lovely. It's great, actually. What's wrong with you? <laughs> hey! Um... I kind of like the Luger. I kind of... Whoa! Extended barrel. We'll go silencer. I like being silent. We have to be. It's a stealth playthrough. That is that I Yes. Bullets in other stuff. Best prices around, I promise. No, no, trade in. Customize. Can I have anything else? Wow! Everything I own is amazing! Well, right, okay. Thank you. I've spent all my money now. Okay. This is I'm, great stuff. Am I actually gonna go the watch a show? Fine. Bullets, I don't know. It's prohibited. Sale. Maybe I'll just get a drink instead. You can drink anywhere. This is a theater. Anything goes. But hey, I won't twist your arm. Just don't come back in 10 minutes when you change your mind. It all begun. Wait a minute, I gotta think. Think faster. He's having a doobie. Good for him. No wonder the world famous Bolshoi Theater is right above that station. There are rumors that there are underground passages from its basement into the metro. And that's the reason why many of its actors and other staff were able to save themselves on Judgment Day. They founded the new Bolshoi down here at, at the station. It is the theater, it is the theater rumors uh, of which reach even the farthest corners of the metro. And since the habitable, 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 <laughs> habitable world ends where the metro lines end, <laughs> you could say that the new Bolshoi is also known around the world. Some say it actually preserves the tradition of its great predecessor. They say that the earth continues to spin while the Bolshoi, uh, Bolshoi still puts on shows. How I wish to see one of those. Perhaps I finally got my chance? Question mark. We're, we're, we're here, right? Can I go in? Hey, buddy, can I go in? Oh my god, you're right. Terrifying. He's a vampire, I think. Bullshit! I'm in! Well, Artyom, I made all the arrangements. We can go to the revolution now. They will Thank you. They will through the theater. Well, a couple of days ago, I was seen on the revenge at the platform hiding from his wife. Come on, don't make us... I just oh. can't hit a woman. Hey, you! Stop! Show me your tickets! Did you hear Oh, sure. Come in. Well, Stanislavski, you can watch the show if you like. I'll wait for you at the dressing room. I get to watch your show! Watching the show at the new Bolshoi. If you'd be so kind. The can can. The can can? Hey! 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 The one on the end um, is out of sync and doesn't know what she's doing. The, the file, yeah, that one. And they certainly have some jiggle physics going on as well. So this is the show. If I go back, actually, they're not wearing much. Just, you know, YouTube won't appreciate it. ...has never witnessed anything like this before. I feel sorry for the other performers now. Their attempts at impressing the audience might fall short after such a spectacle. But <laughs> I trust they will handle the race part of our expectations. And thus, our incredible show continues. This man spits in the eye of danger, challenges nature, defies the god of his new world, and proves once again that humanity is a master of all. Oop. A warm welcome for Leonid Burley, our animal trainer extraordinaire, with his uh, terror of our city. Um. Let go. Let's go. 
He doesn't want to. Stupid freak! I will fight you! Impressive victory as human intelligence triumphs over the mutants. Speaking of mutants, even our station has heard the rumors of new species that were encountered at exhibition. Fearsome beasts, black as midnight, invincible, able to induce madness in anyone who saw them. What? But even those were no match for human ingenuity. The guys at exhibition had noticed they were growing the wrong mushrooms. <laughs> But I lived there. And even back to the traditional recipe, the new mutants were gone like morning dew. <laughs> <laughs> Let us cheer for the heroes at exhibition. And tonight's show goes on. It is time to bring a lyrical mood to our show. We give you the genius of chamber music. The famous accordion player, Kolya Pajarny, with his masterpiece, My Heart Reaches for the Sky, but hits the ceiling and falls down the bottle. A round of applause, please. What a title. Oh, he is very drunk. Thank you for wearing something, ladies. Some extra bounce to this for some reason. will never sound the same. Is he crying? It's not just streams with so much power. I better get good karma for this. And thus, our incredible show continues. Uh -oh. Today, I have the honor of presenting to you the hottest, the most explosive act this side of Atlantic Ocean. The most scorching spectacle of today. Our Someone's fire show. Oh God! A round of applause to welcome the performers. Please. Someone's, someone's Please. gonna die. Gentlemen. Gentlemen. shows will always make me nervous, you know, because it's fire and it doesn't give a shit. It can't be tamed like an animal. If, if, if you fuck up, you're gonna be seriously hurt or die. I would be sweating so much doing that. Oh, that was it. Completely mind-blowing, incredible, simply incredible. If a tiny bit too hot, just a couple of degrees higher, and I'd be charmed. <laughs> Thank you, dear friends. Thank you. But I must say that however hot that was, the girls were a bit hotter still. <laughs> Guys, you've got to answer the challenge. Try using the flamethrower, perhaps. <laughs> And yet, we have more, dear audience. Please welcome the Arpeggio Virtuoso, the God of Legato, and Demon of Tremolo. The favorite student of Mel Bay and Vladimir Manilov, the premier guitarist of the New Age, Victor Minchuk with his fantasies. 
Please Vic welcome our virtuoso. I understood none of that. I heard guitar. I hear a guitar now. One guy playing a guitar. Very well. I bet his fingers are like just calluses. He's not playing that. This is just, this is a recording. Where are your girl dancers? Hmm? You don't have fire. You don't have girls. You can just finger really well. Is anyone actually enjoying this or? Yeah? You were at this ecstasy and my heart would ignite, my legs would start dancing, and my soul would go straight to wherever it's heading to. Thank you, Victor. Where are you, Ladies where, and gentlemen, is that it? I must announce a change in today's program. To okay. our sincere regret, our visiting magician ran out of ladies for his sawmill act. <laughs> We have filled the gap with greatness. Your complete attention, please, as I present the birth of a legend. The Minchu and Pajarni duet with their instrumental impromptu, The Song of Songs. The Song I of Songs. I applause to cheer our great musicians on. Do it. The best show of all time. With no girls? Are we serious? Excuse me, piano man, you could join in, it could be a trio. for the karma, by the way. I don't know if it's ever going to end. Incredible. Completely incredible. My left ear is still ringing. So, how many more acts? I just heard the virtuosos of the Moscow underground. The duo known as Minchuk and Pozarny. Our dear audience. This sad moment always come, no matter how often we wish you would not. But our show for today is over. I hope you've enjoyed it as much as we have enjoyed your company. I have, Thank it's been you. great. And please come again. Maestro, give us something emotional. Goodbye, farewell. Parting is such sweet. I got karma. Oh, the girl's back on. All right. Artyom, no? Enjoy the show? Yeah, um, great. Sorry, man. Time to move on, you patron of the art. Oh. Avert your eyes. Oh, Pavel Igorovich. So glad to see you. Hi. Where have you been? You don't like us anymore. Uh, whoa. Helen, no, sto, I'm, I'm totally in love with you girls, but I've been busy with work. I'm, I'm very, very sorry. I'll come back soon. I promise. Yeah, I feel like Jana, I have to look at the floor. Your powder. In your dreams, Hi. You use that. You're very nice. It's no good. Why can't your boyfriend buy you something better? Her boyfriend is cheap. That's okay. Here you? we are. No. Artyom, looks like you're a bit woman hungry, huh? Well, Baby. Yes. yes, it's a hard life without a soft woman. I know. <laughs> we having dinner now? Anyways, I tell you, we should be going, but uh, let's drink to the fact we're still alive, huh? It's on me, okay? Why do I feel like a betray- a betrayal? Betrayal? Hey, 
Do over a special on the old dog been infusing it for half a year. Opa, that's great. So, let's drink, Artyom. Smooth stuff, huh? And this is a good place, but yeah, home is the best, you know? Yeah, I've traveled all over the metro, and people talk all kinds of shit about the red line. That it's awful there, there's no food, that we shoot comrades for nothing, and you can't even tell a joke without getting arrested. Wait, let's have another drink. Here goes, Artyom! I feel like I'm being swindled. Wow. So, <clears throat> yes, our life is a bit strict. One party, one leader, one ideology, but we have order. And everything is shared. Food, medicine, fuel, shelter. No rich men, true. But no beggars either. Another drink. And now, to equality. Come on, Artyom. No, 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 no. Pay that now. Ooh, хорошо прошла. Ah, where was I? Ah, uh, yes. Yes, look, look at the far stations. They freaking eat each other. Sell their kids as slaves. It's like the Stone Age. Left to his own devices, a man becomes a beast, you know? Order, order is all that matters. That's, that's our salvation. So you can believe whatever, but I am red. I am red until the day I die. I drink to order. Blin. Come on, Artyom, come on! Bottoms up! We're supposed to be going Bottoms on an up. adventure! So, my friend, that's how it goes. Don't be mad, Artyom. Just doing my job to protect the red line. And you, Musketeer, are from the wrong side of the barricade. Private, take this comrade in. Yes, Majors, yes, sir. It is private. I, um... That was so stupid of me. I bought that talk of friendship. The stupid musketeer saying, Just you wait. And we'll get even. I wonder though, why did Pavel go through the trouble of trapping me? Yes, it's a question, seen as I saved his life from being hung by Nazis, and now I'm his prisoner. I knew I was being swindled. Move it! Hey, stop that, blood! He's just being over enthusiastic, you know? Artyom, look, I think of you as my friend, really. No, you don't. But as a soldier, you understand that I had to follow my orders and bring you here, okay? Now you're under arrest, but perhaps it's not the end of the line for you. I hope. We, the people of the red line, have one day, sir. Good day, sir. At ease, Tavarish. So, you're doing good here? Are you not? Yes, sir. Comrade Moskvin is here, inspecting the troops. The Secretary General? Yeah. What about Comrade Korn? Yes, sir. Comrade General is here, too. Opa, it's my lucky day, huh? Okay, things are moving faster than we anticipated. Look, Artyom, you're a smart guy, so we understand there is no such thing as coincidence. You are here because we need information. So, my advice to you, my friend, go up. No! Okay. But don't worry, I got your back. Because we are what? Musketeers! All for one, and one for all. But your comrades in the order, their motto is all for us. War is coming, my friend. That bunker you guys found, whoever controls it survives and fuck the rest of us. But we have been preparing for this. And I want you to join us, too. No. Oh god, more important people? Oh, he's got psycho eyes. Good day, Comrade General. Comrade Morozov, I was beginning to think you had not survived your mission. I was captured, Comrade Corbett. This stranger here, uh, saved me. What a coincidence. He's Nitsky, one of the Spartan Rangers. Do you know this man? Yes, sir. His name is Artyom. Miller trusts him. They found the six together, 
He's also earned several commendations since official enlisting with the Order. Well, I am overjoyed to meet you, Comrade Artyom. I think we both have something to offer. Take the Comrade to the negotiation room. That, uh, that, that guy that was talking about us, we heard about him in D6. They were looking for where he Your was. Man. He ran Let's away. He might have been a spy. This telepathic mutant, the so-called Dark Bomb, is of extreme scientific significance. Tell me all you know about it, and I will allow you to keep your life and your job with the Rangers. But, as my spy, an operative, just like those uh, musketeers, one for all, and all for... Secretary General Comrade Moskvin. Gorbut, I need a moment. And what do we have here? Is that Hitler? Another enemy of the revolution? <laughs> Perfect. As you have always noted, Lunia must start learning how to improve his uh, people skills. As a matter of fact, we were... Yeah, put away your truth serums. I'll show you a more traditional Red Army method. Faster and more effective. Okay, what do you want? You shit! Spill your guts now! Tell everything you know of these six. <laughs> nah. <laughs> oh, fuck. Still nothing, huh? <laughs> okay, bitch. You talk, or I'll fry your balls in pig fat. Passwords, code names, operation protocols. What are you doing, Dad? This is called interrogation, Lonia. Interrogation. Business as usual. What? You never did that playing dolls? No! You little shit! There's no power without blood! There is! Your brother ruled peacefully, and they still love him! Get back here! You're a thug! God damn it! Butcher. All right. Use your drugs. Use hot pokers. Just get everything out of him and shoot the bastards! Then come to my office. Okay. I'm gonna kill Pavel. This is painful. Oh, I must agree with Leonid. Brutality is a crooked path to information. I believe in science. One injection and you will tell us everything. I was gonna say no. Was oh, the dark one still in my mind? Or nearby. <laughs> or are we just going into our own mind? <laughs> Time to go, little ones. To watch him? <laughs> Protected him? I need you to go to Venice and take care of the locals who made the delivery. This will not be a cash payment. Understand? Completely, sir. And uh, what about the dark one? The creature has been located. The details are in this envelope. You will pick up the animal right after you go to Venice. Don't disappoint me this time. I won't, Comrade General. I, uh, I won't. Fuck Corbett. Fuck my father. And Morozov. And the revolution and my own future. I'd rather be shot and end up like father. Killing his own brother. Oh, wow. Listen. If you get out of here, oh. just... Well... Dude, Just live. dude, you're gonna get shot by your own dad. Here, get in there. This is the way to freedom. Believe me. Oh. I know. <laughs> Got any guns? I spent all my childhood hiding from my father in those vents. You got any guns? Oh, fine. I'll just go. Well, good luck to you. 
Thank you, I'm going to extract revenge on a certain few people. Maybe I should eat the green mushrooms for power. They look like they're energized. Obviously energized. If you if it glows. Let's talk. Yeah, let's talk. Negotiations in police. Ah, so you already know. Why? I am the head of intelligence after all. Then why did you let the information leak? Damn the refugees. Polis, Hansa, and even the fucking Nazis already know about our plans. The rats will be exterminated. And war is inevitable anyway. Inevitable? I have my doubts. So does the Politburo. A doubtful man is a fearful man. How dare you! You're the head of state security, and you report to me! Yes, but now, when we are one step away from a unified Red Metro, you have no right to disrupt the plan. I have no right? That's what he said. I'm... Moscovin, when you asked me how to deal with your elder brother when he was still the Secretary General, I helped you. And after his tragic death, I bucked your takeover. So I suggest you take my advice again. This is unacceptable. It's very simple, Comrade Moskvin. We all stand together, arms linked against the wind. Or it's every man for himself. But, Corbett, is this whole fucking metro truly worth the blood we're going to spill? I have a way of doing it without spilling any blood. No blood, you say? All right. Go do your trick. Explanation? Explanation. I'm going to do it without spilling any blood. All right, just go do it then. The frontal assault is hopeless. But if we go underground to the church, advance through the catacombs, then attack from the rear, we should encounter little or no resistance. Then we just have to do a sweep. Attention, Comrade General. Soldiers. You are trusted with an important mission. Each group has its task, and you have been told only what you need to know to succeed. But remember that this operation is top secret, and you must not be taken alive by the enemy. I hope that I am understood. Questions? Can we use radios after we capture the assigned ducts? Only in case of emergency, and on a scrambled frequency. If we're faced with strong enemy counterattacks, do we hold the positions or fall back? Hold them. Anyway, the enemy is unlikely to mount an effective counteroffensive. Comrade General, we have been issued a banner along with the other gear, but we were also made to remove all our markings. We will leave no trace of our operation. Only upon victory and receipt of the following signal will you raise your banner over the captured targets. Further questions? No, Comrade General. Good luck then. Surrender! Surrender! Oh wow, they're sending out a special forces group to do some dirty work. I'm gonna kill the Comrade General and then I'm gonna stop. Now I am in a real spider infested catacombs, where the General Secretary Moskvin does not look like the head spider. That title clearly belongs to General Corbett. I sure would like to know what's on his mind. What did Lesniski bring him from D6? What's going to destroy the enemies of the revolution? Only questions and no answers. The only thing that is clear, Pavel has information on the Dark One, which makes him my current target. Oh, we are going after Pavel, but that is going to be in the next video. Wow, a lot to take in. I haven't really spoken that much simply because there's a story unfolding and, you know, you guys have asked me to go slowly through it and watch uh, the story unfold around me, not kind of push myself through it. Because I could have got through a lot more had I just ignored everything. But we got to watch a show. Who doesn't like shows? And there was just jiggle physics. Perfect. Anyway, guys, in the next episode, looks like we're going after Pavel. And then we're probably going to go after Corbett. And then we're probably going to have to go after uh, Moskvin. So... That's going to be fun. I really like how this story is unfolding. I'm really... Because now we've seen, like, 
memories of a dark one helping Artyom when he was a child. But, you know, I think that is what happened. Either way, guys, I'm going to stop rambling. Thank you very much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed the video. I will see you next time. Bye.